Hello guys. So we all know that the Dragon revamp, rework, awakening, whatever it is, is coming soon. We recently got the official Dragon icon released, leaked by the creator of the Blocks Fruits manga, Toby D. Artist. It's looking good, it's got a cool looking flame circle around it, and the dragon itself has a more menacing look. Now the dragon update was supposed to release last year, but it has been delayed. It's now the middle of January, and it looks like things are picking up the pace. We've gotten a lot of leaks from developers, and it looks like it should be ready to be released soon. Since the dragon update is coming soon, a fan has released a game of what this upcoming dragon rework will probably look like. We have a club, and this is the One Piece character Kaido's club from his hybrid form. It has some attacks, which is pretty impressive for a fan-made game. It even can kill other players. Right here in my hands is the dragon fruit in this game. It looks extremely good. I would not be surprised if this is the dragon fruit that's in the game when the next update releases. Look at the flames around the fruit. It looks so good, I can't believe this is a fan-made game. This looks exactly like the dragon fruit on the Blocks Fruits 2023 roadmap that Rip Indra posted on his Twitter account. I'm trying to press some buttons to see if there are any other attacks or moves or even transformations. Was that wings? For a second I saw wings flapping. This is really cool, we got wings that can help us fly. Once again, this looks amazing. This literally could be in the game. It's not that fast, so I would expect it to be faster in Blocks Fruits if they use these wings. Still, this looks amazing. It looks like there is something down there. I see a Christmas tree and something that's long. It looks like it might be a dragon model. There are flames around the Christmas tree, it looks kinda odd. I don't know why they added a Christmas tree. This must be the flames used on the dragon fruit model. Right across is the dragon model. It's extremely long. I don't really understand why the tail looks like that. It's probably the only thing in the game that does not look good enough to appear on Blocks Fruits. I'm approaching the upper part of the dragon. It looks way more detailed. Yes, this is it. It's amazing. The detail is crazy, and it has the flame circle around the dragon like in the dragon icon leak. This literally could be in the game if they just fixed up the tail. Oh, we got some moves that I did not know we had. I guess I'll press all the remaining buttons I have not pressed yet and give you guys a showcase of all the moves. I did not expect that at all. We can transform into a dragon. The tail actually looks good when it's moving like that. Forget everything that I said before about the tail. Blocks fruits. If you are struggling with the dragon model, this is a model that's ready and actually looks insanely good. The dragon moves so slow. I'm moving like one centimeter per second. This is not the speed of a dragon, it's like the speed of a sloth or a slug. The moves used in the dragon form are not aligned the way they are supposed to be, so that would be another fix this fan would have to make. 
I would assume that the fan would just make the moves in dragon form look more powerful by increasing the flames and everything. That gives that powerful, destructive, worth 5,000 Robux look. That's everything about the upcoming Dragon Update. If you want the link to the fan-made game and try out the revamped Dragon Fruit, make sure to check in the descriptions below. Thanks for watching and see you next time.